All right, here we are at 906 Shipyard. And just to show you around, this is a short street and there's the end of the cul-de-sac right there. And then you can see right there is where you turn off of the other street. So about maybe nine homes, 10 homes on this street. Nice little gravel path there to the left of the garage leading to the backyard. few brick steps leading up to a big, long, wide porch and entryway. This house has been renovated, as you'll see when we get inside. So when you walk in, you have your garage to the left, coat closet right here, and then to your right you have the bedrooms. We'll start with the bedrooms. Spare bedroom number one here. And there's a hallway there leading to the bathroom and the other bedroom. But first we have an office or storage or kind of an odd room, but it is not too big. No windows, obviously, no closet but it's some space, maybe a doggy room where they can sleep and have their beds and everything. Who knows, but heading back out again, for reference, there's the front door. We continue down, we have a linen closet here in the hallway. And here is the spare bathroom. So you have a shower tub combo there, sink here, mirror and lights. This was that first spare bedroom we looked at. And then here is the other spare bedroom here. Both of your spare bedrooms look out to the front yard. Double closets in this one. They both have ceiling fans. You do have popcorn ceiling, just to note that. He renovated, but did not keep the, get rid of the popcorn ceiling. So again, this would be the walkthrough to that other bedroom. So back out, if we head right here is the master. So you have a closet here. So that's pretty much the space that you have. Master bedroom, ceiling fan as well in here. This one looks out to the backyard, but do note that you have one of the HVAC systems right there, but you can see the water beyond. So this is the master bedroom. There is a second closet in here. View out the window to the side yard and neighbor's backyard area. Master bathroom, you have the walk-in shower. You have a one sink vanity. Toilet is here. Then we have a linen closet. So back out to the hallway here. Check out the garage. door leads to the kitchen area and then of course there is a door leading out to the side yard so you have two garage doors however getting a second car in here wouldn't work because of the steps that were built to go upstairs um, you get a golf cart in here 
maybe a very narrow car if you pulled it in sideways. Not quite sure though, but just take note of that. And then we do have steps. attic space up here. Lots of storage space. It looks like maybe at one point they wanted to have thoughts of finishing this, but more than likely it was just used for Christmas decorations and whatnot. But as you can see, it is quite a large area for storage. So, shut the store. All right, heading back down the steps. So while the steps do keep you from really making this a two car garage, it is giving you attic and storage access, so. You do have a water softener here, which is very common in Fairfield Harbor because the water is harder in our area. All right, so again, front door, the bedrooms where we looked, and now we have the living room area. High ceilings to one side. You do have the skylight. Ceiling fan. And then you have the very large Carolina room out here. Two ceiling fans here. Of course, the beautiful view of the lake or pond, I guess, really, um, out here. Nice built in area here for entertaining. My one question would be why they never brought these windows a little lower. So if you were sitting down, you would have a view of the pond, but you know, sliding glass doors would have been nice there. You do have access to the deck from here, as well as the kitchen dining area. Just another view of the living room. Here's the laundry room. Your water heater is in here. Washer and dryer would go there. You have storage above and a sink. So, nice laundry room. Here is the formal dining room with access to the back deck. Here is a half bath right off the kitchen with some storage space down at the end. And then here is the kitchen. And that door at the end is the access to the garage. So granite countertops, stainless appliances. There's the LVP flooring throughout the home. And then here's an Eden area, again with view of the pond. And then there is access to the side yard area and that path that leads from the driveway to the backyard. So that is the kitchen and the dining room. And again, your half bath. So let's head outside. You have a new wood deck here. Completely new. Brick patio, small area there. And again, that is that path that leads out to the driveway. And then you have small wooded area here. And then the view of the pond. And the golf course, as you can see, is beyond that pond. So, 
that is 906 Shipyard.